涙の色はエメラルドブルー宝石みたいに光ってる Welcome, Magic Brands. It's Crazy Katana. It's another Friday, and we have a six pack of Kamigawa. This is our last six pack in the Draft Booster box. I appreciate you all joining me throughout this journey、um, and spending your pre weekend or our weekend kickoffs together. So let's get started. First pack is Paper Craft Decoy, Virus Beetle, Greater Tanuki,、um, The Trespassers, Moth Rider Patrol, Tawashi. Song Shaper, Kaito's Pursuit, Heir of the Ancient Fang, Tamiyo's Completion, Tales of Master Shishiro, Silver Fur Master, Twin Shot Sniper, Enthusiastic Me Mechanut, and the rare for this pack is the March of Swirling Mist. It's an instant. As an additional cost to cast a spell, you may exile any number of blue cards from your hand. This spell costs two mana less to cast for each card exile this way. And up to X target creatures will phase out. There's a forest for the land in the pack and a token that I have not yet gotten, a Kaito, and it is an emblem. Whenever a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, search your library for a blue or black creature. Creature card, put it onto the battlefield and shuffle. So super cool there. Moving on to pack number two, I am still remaining hopeful that this draft booster box will have the showcase Wandering Emperor. That would be ecstatic, and I still am waiting on an Invoke Despair, among just some other things to complete the set. Brute Suit,、um, Bearer of Memory, Moon Snare Prototype, Imperial Oath. Ambitious Assault, Lethal Exploit, Jujukai Preserver, Peerless Samurai in the Borderless, Moon Circuit Hacker. Azusa's Mini Journeys, Roadside Reliquary, Okibawa Savage, Colossal Sky Turtle. The rare for this pack is Ryu Storm's Edge, and this is in the Borderless and the Special Samurai Treatment. It is a first strike 3 3 whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone and tap it. If it's the first combat phase of the turn, there is an additional combat phase. After this phase. So cool samurai, very neat treatment there. Then we have a dual land blood fell caves and a samurai token. Moving on to pack number three to get us almost to our halfway point for our pre weekend special the Ecologist Terrarium, Crackling Emergence, Return to Action, Harmonious Emergence, Moonfolk Puzzle Maker, Light the Way, a Gonjo Exemplar in the Full Arts, Kami of Restless Shadows, Imperial Subduer. Boseiji reaches Skyward, Twin Shot Sniper, Silver Fur Master, Patchwork Automation. The rare for this is the Mirror Box. It is a, a three mana artifact. The quote legend rule does not apply to permanents you control.、Hmm. Each legendary creature you control gets plus one, plus one. Each non token creature you control gets plus one, plus one for each other creature you control with the same name as that creature. Pretty cool. Scour Baron, Stool Land, and Human Monk for the token. And we will move on to pack number four. Come on, Wandering Emperor, you are hiding in here somewhere. Spell Pierce, Network Disruptor, Spirited Companion, Kindled Fury, Reckoner Shakedown, Fade into Iniquity, Ink Rise Infiltrator in the Borderless, Sky Swimmer Koi, The Fall of Lord Conda, Malicious Malfunction, Thirst for Knowledge. Banishing Sash, Slash, and we have a mythic in this pack. This is so cool.、Um, there's a dragon in each color.、Um, I definitely do not believe I have the green. So, this is Kura, the Boundless Sky Dragon Spirit. It is three and two green. Flying Death Touch. When Kura, the Boundless Sky, dies, choose one. Search your library for up to three land cards, reveal them, put them into your hand, then shuffle. And、the other option is cre create an XX green spirit creature token where X is the number of lands you control. So beautiful card here. And that is also followed by a foil rare, the Weaver of Harmony Snake Druid. It's an enchantment creature. Other enchantment creatures you control get plus one plus one for、uh, one green and a tap. Copy target activated or triggered ability you control from an enchantment source. You may choose new targets for the copy. It is a 2 2, but that foil is so, so pretty. So cool pack, a mythic, and a rare. Then we have the Swiftwater Clips, Clips for dual land and the Samurai token. Moving on to pack number five. These have not disappointed at all. There is an Aki War Paint, a Thundersteel Colossus Experimental Synthesizer, Undercity Scourger. Careful Cultivation, Mononic Sphere, Kitsune Ace, 
Heir of the Ancient Fang, and that is in the Borderless Treatment, Tamiyo's Completion, Okiboa Reckoner Raid, Flame Discharge, Reinforced Ronin, uh, Norika Yamakazi, the Poet in the Special Treatment, Full, Art, and Borderless, and then we have the Rare for the Katos, the Silent Spider, Legendary Creature, Human Ninja. Um, when she enters the battlefield, exile target card other than basic land from an opponent's graveyard. Search that player's graveyard, hand, and library for any number of cards with the same name as the card and exile them. Then that player shuffles for as long as you control Katos. You may play one of the exiled cards and you may spend mana as though it were mana of any color to cast it. A standard forest for the, um, for the land and a colorless or blank token. Um, and then this is our last pack. So this is the final six pack in the Kamigawa Draft Booster Box. I'm so glad and so thankful you joined me for this. Um, for all of our pre weekend openings, Iron Apprentice, Clawing Torment, Geothermal Kami, Futurist Sentinel, Wanderer's Intervention, Unstoppable Ogre, Peerless Samurai, Netsumi Blade Master, Era of Enlightenment, Thirst for Knowledge, Doshuki Silencer, Malicious Malfunction, Invoke Justice is the rare. So this is the white. While we didn't get the Invoke Despair in the black, we did get Invoke Justice in the white. It is a sorcery for one and four white. Return target permanent card from your graveyard to the battlefield, then distribute four plus one plus one counters among any number of creatures and or vehicle target player controls. And you have the Seven Tail Mentor in the beautiful foil, three and a white, Far Fox Samurai. And the full art planes. So we got the beautiful planes um, in the Kamikawa. And last but not least, the treasure token. I can't thank you all enough for joining me for these um, card openings with Kamigawa. It's been one of the um, sets that I've just enjoyed most. So hopefully you all have as well. There'll be all kinds of new things with magic coming out here soon. And so I hope to open some of that with you. I would love for you to engage and drop in the comments and let me know what you'd like to see on this channel. Again, I thank you so much for watching. I really enjoy opening packs with you and I look forward to doing many more. <laughs>